Welcome to this Okta support video on how to create a scope for your authorization server in Okta. In this guide, we'll walk you through the steps to create scopes, which are high-level operations that allow or deny access policies to API endpoints. This guide applies to Okta environments with the API Access Management SKU. To create a scope for your authorization server in Okta, follow these simple steps. Log into the Okta admin dashboard and select Security API Authorization Servers. Select the name of the authorization server you want to edit from the Okta dashboard. Click the pencil icon to start editing the existing authorization server. On the Authorization Server Details page, click on the Scopes tab and then click the Add Scope button. Enter a name and description for the new scope. Optionally, Select the default scope checkbox to allow Okta to grant authorization requests to apps that do not specify scopes on an authorization request. Select a user consent option, implicit, optional, or required. If you selected optional or required for the user consent, clear the block services from requesting this scope checkbox. The implicit option is the default setting, where the user isn't asked to grant the app access to the information and the user's consent is implied for this scope. Click the Create button to create the new scope. Creating scopes for your authorization server in Okta is easy with the steps we've just covered. Scopes are essential in granting or denying access to specific high-level operations on API endpoints. Be sure to keep your scopes up to date as your application's needs evolve. Don't forget to check out Okta's support playlist for more helpful videos.